this is the entrance to per se. It's the French Laundry of the East Coast. Oh man, this is gonna be one incredible meal tonight. They've got a table all set for me. Let's see what goes down tonight. I feel so fancy with my non-alcoholic cider. Mm. Nice little cracker to start. And then this bad boy, a little tuna tartare cone. I always get scared the algorithm's gonna think it's something it isn't. What's it look like to you? <laughs> it's delicious, that's what it is. It's a curry cauliflower balutin with black mission figs, or kernel almonds, a little brown butter in there for you as well. Sauce me up. Can't remember if I said sultanas or golden raisins yet, but uh, they're in there too. Beautiful. They call this the fish canapes. Four different rounds of fish. Yeah, this looks fantastic. Can you guess what these are? I hope so, because I can't remember them all. I do know that that's scallops, and that one is soft shell crab. We're up to our seventh food item, and we're not even on to the main menu stuff yet. Tasty menus are so freaking awesome. Let's dig in. If there was a fine dining hall of fame, this is a dish that would be in there. It's never left the menu here or at the French Laundry. Oysters and pearls. You've got some oysters, you've got some caviar, and of course, mother of pearl spoon. So shiny and delicious. This one, you want a huge bowl of it. Uh-oh, a little tapioca in there. Mm. So here we have the hen and custard, black truffle ragu, fish with a chive potato chip. Very nice, yeah. A little translucent chip, as cool as can be. Pretty looking dish, huh? Would you eat this? Yeah. What if I told you it's foie gras? Some people have a problem with that. This guy right here is not one of those some people. So much flavor, some crunch. How about this roll? Ooh. That is fluffy. And the game continues. <laughs> yeah, baby. So this is your Mediterranean Lubina. Paired with Pichelin olives, compressed Persian cucumbers, and salt and gold bar squash emulsion. And of course, the sourdough bread. Try sourdough bread, yeah. Had to do a second type. Exactly. Butter poached main lobster tail. So the sauce at the base of it is a sweet carrot emulsion along with green pea puree right around. And right above it, the chip is a palm maxine. It's cute. Uh, I'm gonna get a peek under the hood. There's the lobster. Yes, look at that bad boy. This is the pigeon dish. Uh, what street did they catch it on? Uh, Central Park South. It's a man <laughs> named Thomas. Hence why they call it Thomas Farm. It's really good. Well, it's fresh caught and fed on pretzels and hot dogs. So it's gotta be good. 48 hour braised short rim with crispy bone marrow, morel mushrooms, and green market meal. Braised beef short rib. So tender, you don't need a knife. All right, you can do it. Come to daddy. There we go. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So a few bites of cheese before you get to dessert. Here you have a warm bougere, 18th month aged Comte cheese, and a black truffle dessert. Awesome, thank you. Of course. And here's round two of desserts. Eight delicious bonbons. Where did it begin? You're looking at probably my favorite tasting menu dessert round in all of America. Crazy, and this isn't even everything. A little chocolate cake, a little fruity cake, donut, four chocolates, or candies at least, but that is my favorite. It's a cappuccino ice cream, and then there's some other ice cream as well. There's more stuff coming too, like eight bonbons. That's the menu, we've crushed it, down to these desserts. Oh man, this is awesome stuff. Let's do it, my friends, cheers. Mm.